written this article this way. It is true. Exactly. It's absolutely true. Can you imagine, instead of talking with the kid, let them try to sleep some or oh, sing a song along. Yeah. But, no, no, do something. Making art is not easy, of course, because, you know, life requires a lot of things. Of course, you have to make money, you have to work, you know, there's the rent to pay, and then, you know, you need to buy a sandwich once in a while because you're hungry, you know, this kind of stuff. Uh, but that, that's a, just a little suggestion I'm trying to give, you know, to whoever feels to be an artist, or whoever feels to have something to say, try to continue, try to, 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 to push. Uh, that's what I've been doing all my life. Yeah, my nan Pia was in my house for more than 30 years. So of course she was, she was already in, in my house when I was born. And I was lucky enough to, to be born in Capri, the island of Capri, Capri, or Capri, like the, the, you say over here, that's it's an amazing place. It's a beautiful island, of course, and I was living the entire year over there. So that's very, very important. She really, it, taught me and she really gave me this kind of sense of uh, how nature uh, was uh, absolutely amazing. Nature is pretty strong, it's beautiful, at the same time it's kind of alarming if you want. And that was this kind of balance, this kind of harmony between the two elements was very, very important for my formation, for my structure. Pierre was able basically to let me play, if you want, let me discover how nature was also offering some kind of toys and at the same time this was a wonderful way to give me the sense of how nature was supposed to be uh, uh, respect and loved of course important and most of all Pierre was able to give me the sense that we human beings are part of nature and this is something we have to keep in mind all the time one of the major reasons of the degradation of the environment is, uh, is this kind of mass mass consumption. This is one of the major issues we got. And we are, and this is not something new, of course. I'm trying to, to use more, you know, leftovers of our culture or our, you know, uh, cultural uh, identities, you know. Uh, instead, buying new materials, if you want. I think it's more important to combine art and some kind of message through art. So, of course, if I use bottles, what are bottles that can try to say something, of course. Not just because they are nice, shiny, and they can become some kind of artistic uh, form, you know. It's, I'm trying to say something, just like with the newspaper. I was trying to definitely say something through the newspapers. You don't decide to be an artist. Basically, there's something in your, I don't know where, <laughs> that tells you to become an artist. It's, a, it's a something that is inside that I don't really know how to explain better. It's, it's, it's there and I can ignore it. It's a strong, strong voice that definitely, whatever I've been doing in my life, you know, was always connected to art, that I was lucky enough to, to, to do that. I've been fighting to do that.